think taking an evening off and having dinner somewhere, what do you picture? Like candles and palm trees? Yes. Yes. That's the way to do it. <laughs> Anywhere where there's peace and quiet. <laughs> How about airplanes getting to getting searched by the TSA. No. The new airport wants to be more than a travel hub and it thinks people will go there just to eat. Is Ukraine certainly unusual, but we've talked about it before actually. And frankly, we just had to learn more about it. So here's Nikki Davidson to explain. In the hustle and bustle world of airports, the brand new MSY was born with a New Orleans flavor. <laughs> Now, airport officials want to beat to the sound of their own drum and welcome in people who are not about to fly far away. People without a ticket will have the option to go where they usually can't, past the security gate. And we had to work closely with the TSA. We couldn't just do this, right? They, they had to bless the program. The director of aviation says the new airport will become one of only four in the country with that approval. The plan is to make the airport a destination itself, one where people can shop and eat, have a date night, even if they aren't about to hop on a plane. Folks really want to come and experience yeah. this facility. The new plan has some out-of-towners confused. Uh, I don't think I would take advantage of it if I lived here. But mention the food. Just, you know, give you somewhere different to go, you know, instead of their same old five or six places you go to eat. And they give it a second thought. Locals see the opportunity for better send-offs. I mean, if I was going to travel, my family has to say goodbye to me. Yeah, so they could actually come in with me and get a meal. It'll take some planning, though. Guests will have to register at least 24 hours in advance and will still go through security like everyone else. The airport is expecting so much interest, they're already planning a cap. Only 50 guest passes per weekday, 100 on Saturdays and Sundays. So if a holiday date night at the airport appeals to you, the program is expected to start the week after Thanksgiving. And Kenner, Nikki Davidson, Eyewitness News. The other airports that allow guests in the terminal are Pittsburgh, Tampa, and Detroit. At this point, New Orleans, there is no special parking area for the airport guests. But you were talking <laughs> about this idea when you went to cover its opening. We did, because it's, the, I mean, the restaurants there are so great. You have Emerald's restaurant back right. there. There's actually a jazz stage. There's a Sazerac bar. It kind of works for a date night. See?